Hi guys, it's Sebastian with Looking Feeling Smelling Great. I'm back with another video for you today. Today we're gonna do first impressions of Loewe O1 Man and Loewe O1 Woman. If you stick around to the end of the video, I'll have a giveaway. Two people, of the subscribers of this channel will win a sample set of both of them if you're in the USA. So please stay tuned. So, uh, Loewe is a Spanish brand owned by LVMH, Louis Vuitton Moet Hennessy brand. And so they launched two new fragrances. This is the first time I've seen these in the stores here in the USA, uh, this brand actually. When I was in Spain, uh, I've been there a couple times, maybe three times now, and when I go to their department stores, all the Loewe fragrances are sold there. It's a big brand there, it's a clothing brand. So they have fragrances, of course, and like I said, it's owned by uh, Louis Vuitton, LVMH. So they've just recently launched these. They're Eau de Parfum, 100 ml, $123. And um, the nose behind both of them is Emilio Valeros. Let's quickly do um, the notes. So for top notes on the man, it's bergamot, mandarin orange, cardamom, heart notes, cypress, sandalwood, vetiver cedar, ambrette, and carrot seeds. And in the base notes, we've got violet, musk, and patchouli. For the woman, we've got in the top, bergamot, tangerine, pink pepper. Heart notes, we've got jasmine and sandalwood. In the base notes, we've got amber and vanilla. So I really like the concept behind them, and I love the photos. They're kind of minimalistic, very artsy looking. Nothing like their other fragrances, which to me, are definitely Spanish uh, looking or inspired uh, designs and things like that. But these look pretty modern and I love them and the boxes and everything and they're 100 ml and I really wanted to check them out. So here it goes, man, we'll open that up. It's actually OO man, Loewe OO man, man right here. So it's like a little book and here is the fragrance itself. So this one actually, I like the bottle. What do you think? Simple, kind of a woody, but it's not really wood. It's a kind of plasticky, look, made to look like wood. And uh, I like I like to explore new fragrance houses, and um, I wanted to give this one a try. So we'll go ahead and spray this one. So that one is sprayed. I'm picking up a little bit of the bergamot, kind of juicy, citrusy thing, and. Um, Cardamom is kicking in, woodsy notes, I haven't even smelled my arm yet. Iris, I'm picking up iris, but I think it's the violet. It kind of has this like powdery, kind of bordering uh, Dior Homme, if you uh, know that fragrance, I'm sure you do. But uh, this one's definitely uh, a lot cooler, not so warm. Um, the carrot seed is definitely prominent and patchouli is definitely big. So I really do like this. This is probably going to be for men who uh, like Dior Homme, but they want a little something different, a little more patchouli, a little more herbal, because I'm picking up like a carroty kind of um, vetiver -y kind of um, woody woodiness. So it's a unique take on that Dior Homme style of fragrance, and I like it. So Loewe 001 for men is a good one for me. So let's try the women's. Different flowers, as you can see. The woman's will give it a try. I think uh, here's the woman's. And we'll spray that on the other one. So here it goes. So this one definitely is floral. But still very masculine. I don't think it's feminine at all. The amber and vanilla with that sandalwood has toned down that uh, jasmine note. But still, it's a it, you know it's jasmine. It's a white flower, but definitely not uh, like screaming in your face kind of a white floral where it's like really like feminine. But definitely, I think it's unisex enough for uh, men to wear as well. And I think. Um, both man and woman can be worn by both sexes, so 
both definitely a good one. I think I, I really like these two, and I've, these are my very first um, Loewe brand fragrances. I never really got into the other ones. As I said, I was in Spain several times, and I smelled all of those that they had at the department stores there at the time I was visiting those three times, and really nothing really uh, did anything for me, but these, I did take with some of them at uh, Barney's where they sell them. They also sell them at Nordstrom's. So I bought these from Nordstrom's because I had my Nordstrom's gift checks that they sent me for spending money. So I decided to buy them there and they actually gave me several of these so that I can give them to the winners. Thank you Nordstrom's. And um, yeah, I'm happy with these two. Both the men's and the, the women's are great. And I really like that Dior own style of fragrance anyway, that powdery kind of lipsticky thing. And this one is a, a different take on it, which is really, really gonna be a unique one to wear. So guys, what are your thoughts about this brand, Loewe? Are you familiar with it? Um, it's a brand out of Spain, like I said. Let me know your thoughts below. And if you don't know anything about them, let me know what you want to know about them and we'll get a conversation started. Also, like I said at the beginning of the video, two lucky winners will win the sample sets. Two of them I have to give. Please make sure you're subscribed to this channel, otherwise you won't qualify. List below why you want to win these sample sets. It's actually um, like this. And there's samples of the man and the woman inside. So, and as I was saying, they're both very unisex to me, so you can, if you're a man, you can try them both. If you're a woman, you can try both too. So, and to see what, what you think of either one of these. They might be perfect for you. All right guys, please like this video, please share it. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and I'll be back with more videos very soon. If you want to pick up these fragrances, I'll have a link below so that you can pick up the fragrance yourself. All right guys, have a good one, goodbye.